fast way to decompose leaves or a fast way to uh, turn leaves into compost. Hello, welcome to Seven Savings Garden, where we talk about gardening, ways to save money, and other special events. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get notified of all upcoming videos. So here, if you're like me, you have a ton of leaves and you want to try to uh, break down or decompose the leaves. So the first way or the best way to uh, uh, decompose leaves and the, turn them into manure or compost is to break the leaves down. You want to break the leaves down into uh, smaller pieces and they're going to decompose, they're going to become um, uh, compost in, in no time if you break them into very small tiny pieces. Stay tuned to the end of the video where I'll give you an even faster way to get compost from leaves. So here I'm using my lawnmower to do that. You can use a lawnmower, you can use a mulcher um, or any other uh, equipment or any other tool you have to break them down. As long as you break them down into smaller pieces, it's going to do the trick. So here I'm just going to use um, this lawnmower to just break it down. Um, it's a tough task but uh, this mower is up to the task. Um, usually if it's a uh, electric mower you might have a difficult time doing it but uh, with the gas power mower you should be able to break it down easily like this so we're just gonna break uh, all the leaves down and so that way it takes much fewer time to uh, pick all of them up in bags and and put them in our compost pile or make a compost pile so we are almost there um for breaking down most of the ones that you see here smaller pieces so this is a regular leaf uh, leaves with no um, broken pieces. So let's look at what um, we have here after I've gone through it with the lawnmower. And uh, as you can see, the pieces are, are much smaller now. Uh, some of them are still bigger, but um, most of them are broken like this. This one is still bigger, but most of them have been broken into smaller pieces. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, back back it and uh, be able to collect all the leaves that were broken into pieces uh, from the lawn into the uh, our composting uh, bin so now we're just gonna bag the leaves and i'm just still gonna use my uh, trusted lawnmower here i just need to pull back attachment to it and then we're gonna collect all the um, all the uh, broken leaves and uh, use them so now i'm just gonna put my take out this attachment here and, and then replace it close that and then put the bag attachment to it so this helps me collect the bags without me raking the leaves or so, so definitely it's an easy way to collect all the leaves just attach your bag attachment like that and you're able to uh, easily collect the leaves and more um lots of. so let's get going let's uh collect all the leaves so as you can see, um, the, the pile of leaves that we had here at the beginning has really gone down because we've broken it down to smaller pieces. And uh, once we, we go through a couple of turns, the bag is full right now. So I'll just take out the bag and uh, we're just going to put it in a, in, a, in a wheelbarrow right here. And then we'll take it to uh, show you how you can break it down much faster into compost. So as you can see, they're smaller pieces, much smaller. Some of them have been broken into like six or eight pieces, which is, um, it gives the microorganisms more space for them to ch um, to uh, break down the leaves. And it's gonna be much faster as compared to just a regular leaf without uh, being broken down. So we're gonna take the leaves to our pile now. So what you can do is you can make a, you can use a net or you can use a uh, wood like this. And just uh, you want to you want you want it to be at least four uh, four feet high, so that way the leaves are gonna be able to ha be compact and they're gonna be able to break down uh, the heat. It's gonna be able to break down much uh, better if it's um, high enough and it has much compact to it. So um, so what you can do is you can use any uh, material to if you have wood you can do a wood uh, or you can use. A, container like this here i'm just using this um cardboard box that i have and uh, what i'm gonna do is just fill it with our uh broken down leaves so i just pour everything in in here and then you what you want to do is every um every time you you pour it like four three or four inches you want to water it down you want to soak it down 
uh, that way they're gonna be able to uh, break down much faster if the leaves are wet as opposed to if the leaves are dry so we're gonna pour it in here so every layer you just want to water it and then continue um, adding another layer so I'm just gonna use this rag to, uh, to spread it around so now we're just gonna water it you want to soak it you want to make sure you soak it very well so that's moist that's gonna help uh, break down much faster as uh, if if it's uh, if it's soaked like this as compared to just leaving it dry if you leave it dry it's not gonna decompose and it's gonna be there for a long time so you want to water it then you add the uh, next layer uh, another two to four inches spread it out and then water it again so like I said if it's moist it's gonna break down much faster so you want to make sure you maintain the pile you want the pile to be moist and even later on once uh, the leaves after a month or two you can just um, if, if it's still dry you want to make sure you come in and just water it and I put, put some water in there just so that the leaves maintain that moisture also if you have leaves or green uh, things like this or grass clippings or leaves or garden waste you can add it to it it's gonna help break down the leaves even further it's gonna provide uh, much needed moisture and other um, uh, heat it's also also gonna help heat up the uh, uh, the pile so just add any green uh, materials that you have another important thing we have to do is make sure that there's no air circulation so I'm just gonna use this half inch um, drill bit to just uh, make some holes so I'm just gonna make a couple of holes on each side and that's gonna allow air into the container and by allowing air into the container it's gonna break down much faster um, as opposed to just having it sealed like this so we're just gonna make some holes and with a tool like this it's very easy to drill and just see with with this it's just gonna uh, at least uh, provide more air flow into the pile uh, thereby activating it and improving the um, the decomposition process so as you can see the uh, I have at least five or six holes on all the sides and look at the pile right here as you can see it's uh, it's up to the top It's at least three or four inches so like I said just make sure that you maintain the uh, moisture of the pile like this and uh, you should be able to uh, get some good results from it within a couple of months. If you're able to turn it, turn it every five to seven weeks. That will help aerate the pile and will help it uh, break down and decompose much faster. Um, also, another way to uh, break down your leaves into compost faster is to use a uh, tumble bin like this. Uh, this is a bin that you just uh, put in your, your leaves clippings inside, add water. And you're able to easily turn the uh, the bin regularly on a daily or weekly basis and it will break down much faster and then you get a compost you can also add leaves uh, to your compost compost pile like this this is my compost pile you can add all the leaves to the compost pile and uh, let me show you here this is what I did um, and this is what you get afterwards it's rich compost you get rich compost like this the next year once you add leaves and all grass clippings to your compost pile so definitely very important to use the um the leaves that you have i'm just gonna add the rest of what i have here on this compost pile next year i should get some good quality compost uh from this pile okay i hope you like the video if you like the video please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to the channel Please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to share. Thanks for watching. Happy growing.